Father, let the heavens be open, inside and outside, online. The mantle for the next level of your destiny. At the count of seven, let it rest upon you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Let it rest upon you. Help them. The mantle for your next level. The grace for a new dimension. Rest upon them. Rest upon them. Rest upon them like fire. Like fire. Let that grace come upon you. Step it to the next level now. Step it to the next level. For my horn as thou exalted as the horn of a unicorn, I shall be anointed with fresh oil. I'm still praying for you. That in the name of Jesus, fresh oil for this season on every aspect of your life, let it rest upon you now. Let that oil rest upon you from heaven. That's it, that's it. Fresh oil everywhere, everywhere, inside and outside. Take that fresh oil. Your ministry will never be the same. Business will never be as usual. The oil that breaks yokes, the oil that breaks chains, the oil that removes patterns, satanic patterns, demonic cycles, I curse them now. The oil that breaks deliverance, let it rest upon you now. Now in the name of Jesus, hear me, just be quiet, just, just be quiet everywhere, there's a work of deliverance God is doing, help them there, help them, everyone that is under the manipulation of controlling powers, witchcraft, household witchcraft, family wickedness, community witchcraft, powers of shrine, Anyone that is under those yokes, I set you free. I set you free. Just be quiet. Allow God to do the deliverance now. I set you free. Let those altars be destroyed. Let those yokes be destroyed. Let those chains be broken. I cause those controlling powers. I cause those controlling powers. Over your finances, I curse them. Over your business, over your career, that spirit of delay hanging over that family, I curse you now. Help them, help them, help that. Ah, my God, help that lady at the door. Ashukata labakate labakatubasia. Those of you outside, in the name of Jesus, I stretch my hands. Anyone that is under the manipulation of satanic power, satanic altars, from today by the power that raised Jesus from the dead, I set you free. I set you free. Let the yoke be broken off your life. I declare that a new day has come for you. Let a new season be opened up for you. Open your hands before you, right now. The anointing for exploits. In finances, in business, in ministry, in every ramification of life, in your career. The anointing for financial breakthroughs, financial overflow. Let it rest upon your life now. Help them. Help that young man there. Let it rest upon your life now. That's it. Take that anointing. By the Spirit. By the Spirit. Let it rest upon your hands. From today, I empower you by the Spirit for exploits. I empower you for financial overflow. Let the favor of God become the natural environment around your life. May all that you lay your hands to do prosper. Hallelujah. Amen.
Wave your hands and give Jesus praise. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Amen. We are not done. Before I make the altar call. I'm seeing 14 to 21. And God says that between 14 to 21 people. That he wants to place a strange prophetic grace on. At the count of three. Inside and outside. 14 to 21 of you. Take that prophetic grace. One. Outside. Take that grace. Take that grace. Take that grace. Take that grace. Two. Help them at the back there. Let your eyes be open to see. Let your ears be open to hear. The Bible says the lion has roared. Who can but prophesy? Take that grace. Strange prophetic order. The order of Deborah. The order of Elijah. The order of Moses. A prophetic anointing that, that will launch you into encounters by the Spirit. Take that grace. Take that grace. Everywhere. Outside. I call you by your prophetic tribe I call you by your prophetic tribe Let that grace manifest This is your season of manifestation For the endless expectation of creation I waited the manifestation of sons of God Let me prophesy over you. You will never be the same. You've touched His grace. Your life must change. You will never be the same. You've touched His grace. Your life must change. I'm seeing five people with an apostolic anointing. Wherever you are, I stir it up. I stir up that apostolic anointing. I'm stretching my hands right now. I stir up that anointing. That apostolic mandate, that apostolic mantle, manifest now. The grace to take territories, the grace to command influence. Take it now by the Spirit. 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 You will never be the same. In the name of Jesus Christ. Tomorrow, I'm going to take time specially to pray for everyone that came from outside Meduguri. Those of us that came from Abuja, from Gombe, from Yola, wherever, across. Tomorrow, I'm going to make a special time to pray and impart those of you from there. Something will shift in your life. I'm telling you, there is an anointing on this house in this season. It's an anointing for rest and ease. And I prophesy to your life in the name of Jesus from today. Let your life become a life of ease and rest. In all that you do, experience ease and rest. Enjoy ease and rest. In the name of Jesus Christ. Wave your hands and give Jesus praise. Father, we thank you. You are worthy to be praised. You are worthy to be praised. My reading. You are worthy to be praised. You are worthy to be praised. You You are worthy. 